welcome back to my study. I want to take us to the beginning of, uh, of Isaiah chapter 30 today. Um, but to get us into uh, thinking, here's a question for us to ponder. When do we think that we can sort out our own problems? And what do we do when we try to sort out our own problems? Have a think about that. OK, great. I oh, don't know what you thought about, uh, but here's a second question for you to think about now. What should we do instead of trying to sort out our problems for ourselves? Have a think about that one. OK, I hope you said something like uh, we, we should go to God and we should uh, bring our problems to God and, and, and pray. Um, and seek the wise counsel of other Christians because that's the right thing to do isn't it when when we when we have problems whether they be problems at home or work or or questions about our, our faith um, the right thing to do is to pray and then to seek out other Christians uh, for, for wise counsel or or, or, or to uh, un, under God uh, use the, the the people around us that he's he's given us uh, maybe profes professionals if that's what we need if we're ill we need need a doctor and so on um what judah did though when she was faced with a problem of assyria coming down from the north was that she thought she would go to egypt to get help now if you know anything about the old testament you will know that Egypt has a long history in the Old Testament and that uh, the Israelites were brought up out of Egypt and, and were told not to go to Egypt. But there they were wanting to form an, an alliance with Egypt to sort out their own problems. They didn't consult God. They didn't go to God's prophets or his seers or, 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 or the priests or anybody. Uh, to find out what they should do. They didn't consult God's word. They took matters into their own hands and they went to seek out uh, help from the very people that God had specifically told them not to go back to for help. What should they have done? Well, they should have opened up God's word, shouldn't they? They should have listened to Isaiah, who was speaking God's truth to them at the time. And Isaiah had said all the way through the book so far that God is the true king and that he is the one that his people should rely on. And he's given evidence as to why God is the one they can rely on. And uh, uh, they, uh, the, the, the people of Jerusalem still decided they were going to make this alliance with Egypt. It's very tempting, isn't it, for us? when we have stuff going on in our lives to just forget to pray just to think that we know the right way to go about things that we know what's best I, I think sometimes I can be guilty of praying last not praying first about things I wonder if that's your experience too we need to come to God don't we and we need to trust him to be the one to sort out our issues. doesn't mean to say we don't then uh, seek help from others, but we do it uh, when we've prayed and we do it alongside wise counsel from Christians who are going to just help us through, uh, through tough times. So I don't wanna really say when your Assyria comes because that sounds a bit trite, doesn't it? But when, when your issues come, when, when you have trouble, what are you going to do next? What am I going to do next? Well, I hope we'll be people who go to the Lord and say, Lord, I've got, a, I've got trouble here. Please, can you help me? Please give me wisdom to know what best to do. And please give me wisdom to know what not to do. Let me pray for us. Our Father, please would ye... Uh, cause us to be people who pray about all sorts of things, about the things that are, are hard in our lives, about the troubles that come our way. Please would you help us to 
uh, to trust ye with those troubles. And when we find ourselves having not prayed about things, having not consulted your word, please would you draw us back and show us that you are the one who rules all things and therefore you're the one to go to for help. We pray this in Jesus' name. Amen. See you very soon.